let's take a look at how you can get twice the field of view with the Seastar S50. The S50's stargazing mode has a new framing feature which lets you increase the field of view with the Seastar S50. Just go into stargazing mode and tap framing. Let's take a look at how it works. Once you tap framing, it will open up controls allowing you to increase the magnification, which is how you increase the field of view up to two times. You can also rotate the field of view, in this case, allowing me to get a better framing of both the Orion Nebula and the Running Man Nebula. Once you've finished rotating and setting a magnification, you can drag the framing over the object to get the precise image that you want. Once you've done that, simply tap Go To as you normally would to begin imaging. I can see actually how it's giving you that increased field of view. So as you can see, what it's actually doing is taking a bunch of images, instead of uh, keeping it over the same area roughly, which is how it normally functions, it goes around kind of in a big circle covering the entire area of your framing. And it takes all of these images of the different parts of the sky in the frame, and it combines them to simulate giving you a larger field of view. Um, the, which is an amazing feature to give you. The downside is that it will take longer to capture enough images to reduce the noise levels to something acceptable. Um, that's because it has to take, you know, let's say you would typically do, for example, an hour's worth of imaging with a normal imaging function or one X frame with a two X framing covering four times the area because it is framing two by two. Uh, it would take, it would take four hours or more to give you the same noise reduction as it would take you to do it at one X. I hope you enjoy using this great new feature in the C-Star S50. If you enjoy this content, please like and subscribe to my channel.